Hi, hello and welcome. It's me Vignesh here and this is your favorite V and data channel. Today we will be seeing unsupervised learning algorithm association about association. Last time we saw about clustering. Today we will be seeing about association for that let's pause into our video. As I told you before, we will be seeing association, right? Like association rule mailing, what are the rules in association rule mailing and so on. Before starting, what is association? Suppose if you are going for a grocery shop or a supermarket, right? You are taking a tea powder, okay? Then we will go for milk, okay? for preparing tea tea powder after that we will go for we will we'll go and take the milk after that we can take sugar as well ok to add sugar like consequent events right if someone is going to take tea powder he will go for milk and he will go for sugar there is a dependency between these three ok this is called a dependency between each and everything uh, the dependency between milk and sugar and tea and milk, tea powder and milk and so on. There will be dependency between each and every product, right? The dependency is found out. That is called association. Another example for this, right? Like we can take ri rice, okay? Rice. Then, if someone is picking rice, he may pick doll as well. Doll. Then, as well as salt so the dependency between the rice and dal has a dependency dal and salt as a dependency this dependency find how we found out the dependency between each and each right each items right that is called association there are some set of rules for this association that is that is called association rules okay association rule meaning set of rules are association rules first one is the support Support is one of the rule, one among the rule, then confidence, then last is the lift. These three are the set of rules, okay. These three are called rules for association. These are the rules for the rules for doing the association thing. Okay. Support is the first one. Second one is the confidence. Third one is the lift. Okay. These three, with the help of these three, we'll come to know what is the association between two products. Okay. Now, how to formulate these three rules? Okay. How to find the value for support, confidence, lift? Okay. We'll see the formulas now. This is a small data set, right? Transaction 1, transaction 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, transaction 8. Okay, there are total 8 transactions. Instead of milk, tea, powder, or rice, we are taking an item 1, item 2, item 3, item 4. Like just giving a code name for it. Okay. Transaction 1 consists of item 1, the person has taken item 2, the same person has taken item 3, and item 4 as well. Okay. The transaction 4, uh, in transaction 4, right? A person has taken item 1 and item 5. He has not taken item 3, 2 or 4. In the transaction 5, right? Item 1, he has not picked pick up. He has taken 2, 3, 4 and 6 in the transaction 5. Depends upon the person to person. What is coming to take or buy from the uh, store. First of all, we will find the support of this. Okay. First one is a support. First one is the support. Support is that in item one, right? How many transaction has been uh, happened for that item one alone? Okay, appeared. Support equal to 
in the total number of transaction item one has been appeared for four day four times that is four transaction item one four times that is four but the total transaction for the day is the total transaction is right it's eight it's four by eight this is support for item one four by two as a support which is, is equal to some value for others it will be like one by two uh, yeah, this is a simple data set for complex data set we will find out how it is okay next one is right second one is the confidence confidence support of item 1 item 1 is this is item 1 this is item 2 item 1 is x right 2 will be y whenever someone is buying x at what times and all at what value confidence level the item y is bought okay whenever y comes what time like x x is getting buyed okay which is coinciding association between both item 1 and item 2 support of 1 and 2 by the ratio support of 1 because we are at what time like if item 1 is coming coinciding with the item 2 okay this is item 1 this is for item 2 okay confidence of item 1 with item 2 coins correlating the item 1 confidence with 2 whenever x or item 1 is bought how much times item 2 or y is bought along with it the value right it will be around 3 out of out of 4 there are 4 transaction item 1 is there in that 4 transaction 3 transaction are correlating item 1 and item 2 ok y values occurred in 3 times through 3 out of 4 transactions that is the confidence of y according to the x that is confidence of item 2 according to or correlating with item 1 next one is the lift 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 is calculated by support of 1 comma 2 so, item 1 and 2 support of item 1 and 2 support of 1 into support of 2 that is support of item 1 into support of item 2 this is gives the uh, like probability of item y uh, how much times is it bought okay. item 2 when it is sold when x is bought okay that is item 1 is bought i am taking milk at how much times or uh, like milk or tea powder is bought along with milk okay this is calculated by lift or oh, this tablet column right i mean it is one for item one like it is no necessary that item one uh, item two is bought along with item one lift must be greater than one if is that is the case then item one or item two will be bought along with item two okay the probability of getting the item two is high if we are going for grocery shop right there will be dal will be in the rack in the nearby rack there will be rice and salt nearby so if a person goes he will buy rice dal and salt ok in the same thing the vegetables will be in a different rack as well as the milk products will be in a different rack they won't mix it up that is because for easy pickup uh, selling it is called market basket analysis like for which product near uh, which product must be placed so that the uh, no, selling is high this is association rule mining now how this is association rules with these rules and values right we will come to a conclusion that which this product can be kept near this product or not okay today we saw association rule association rule mining and what are the rules in it how it is worked in real time okay in the next video we will be seeing uh, association rule mining algorithm association algorithm 
and how to code it in python and check it out until then it's me vignesh thank you